Question of the Week from the Naked Scientists. Hello and welcome to Question of the Week. This week we're answering questions sent in by listener Natalie. She asks, Did women in the Paleolithic era cook the food the hunter-gatherers brought back? Good question, Natalie. To answer your question, we are picking the brains of paleoanthropologist at the University of Cambridge, Dr Emma Pomeroy. I mean, this is a really good question. And I think, unfortunately, the answer is that we don't know. The question itself does reflect some of our assumptions. And actually, if we look at the ethnographic record, so what recent forager societies do, actually, we see both men and women cooking food and quite often cooking food, you know, on the go. If they find some tubers or if they hunt a small animal, they'll make a, a small fire and, and cook the food and, and eat it sort of as they're, as they're moving around. Did they bring more substantial things back? Would that be a different case then? Would they need to cook that on site? Yeah, I mean, sometimes food is brought back to a central place and might be cooked with a, a more substantial fire. But quite often, I think we see that it's both men and women getting involved in that, sort of all members of the community. There's also the question of whether actually we can assume that any kind of gender roles and gender division of labour actually applied in the past as well. And again, that's been pretty controversial. People have tried to look at whether we can see differences from the skeleton in what men and women are doing. Uh, but linking that back to cooking specifically is really hard. So is it more of a case of whoever found it cooked it? Yes, quite possibly, or that people cooked it as a group with various people chipping in if it's something larger, more substantial that's going to be shared. Thank you very much, Natalie, for your question. And thank you to Emma Pomeroy for the answer. Next week, we're answering this question from listener Catherine, who, after her cataract surgery, had this to inquire about her new set of eyes. Why is it? with replacement lenses, which are fantastic. Does facial recognition still work, but biometrics do not seem to? And if you do have a question of your own, or you think you know the answer to this one, the email address is chris at nakedscientist.com or join us on the forums, nakedscientist.com forward slash forums. Question of the Week is part of the Naked Scientists podcast and supported by the Wellcome Trust and UK Fast. Look us up online at nakedscientists.com.